what do you think governments can do to either stay away from or do away with nuclear weapons? Um, well, first of all, um, we have to stop playing American and Russian roulette with everybody and everything. At the moment, <coughs> there are some 2,000 nuclear weapons in the United States and Russian nuclear arsenals, and the US and Russian nuclear arsenals together comprise some um, 25, 26,000 nuclear weapons and are 95% of all the nuclear weapons that there are. And um, those 2,000 weapons are kept in permanent launch on warning status. That is to say they're able to be launched within two minutes. And <coughs> there's been a series of totally hair-raising incidents in which it would be quite literally true to say that the world has nearly ended, generally due to some dumb computer error or some human mistake somewhere. Okay. Um, and as long as those weapons are kept in that configuration that they're able to be launched within two minutes, and as long as presidents and military staff have got um, between 30 seconds and about 12 minutes to decide whether or not to destroy the world, um, then we have a, a decision-making problem, and that problem has basically got to disappear. That's a first step um, that we must take simply to assure human and civilization survival. Um, and after that, we can move on to the other steps that are needed um, to assure the abolition of nuclear weapons. Okay, so that's what governments can do that have nuclear weapons, but what about those that perhaps don't have nuclear weapons but are either considering it or are trying to uh, change the global norms to ensure that superpowers don't hold themselves to a different standard than other countries? Well, most of most of the um, of the governments of the world fall into the second category right. that you've described. Right. Um, so 95 percent of all the governments that there are um, clearly um, want the nuclear weapon states to abide by their um, their spelled out legal obligations under the Nuclear Non-Proliferation Treaty to get rid of nuclear weapons. And I mean it's worth saying that if everybody simply abided by their legal obligations under all the various treaties of the world, but particularly under the Nuclear Non-Proliferation Treaty, um, and if the decisions of the General Assembly um, were ever remotely near being enforced, oh then this whole problem mm. would simply not be, be there. Um, nuclear weapons are illegal. Everybody knows they're illegal. The ICJ has reiterated that they are illegal and their lack of legality is embedded in a heap of, um, of, of General Assembly resolutions. Yeah. Um, the General Assembly has has so many times passed resolutions that provide a clear step-by-step -step path um, for the elimination of nuclear weapons. If even one of those resolutions were ever implemented, we would not be talking about this now.